sea day. The first one of the cruise. We don't got a lot planned today. I know I said last night we might do a ship tour or something. Maybe we will do that. Right now we're going to breakfast. We're going to go to the dining room. See what that's about. And then we're just going to relax. What do you think? Yep. It's going to be fun. And we got to go look at the trail because it'll be like the first time we can see it in the daytime since we've been on the ship. There you go. The rest of the time it's been dark or in port or whatever. So, off to breakfast. We'll catch up with you as we do stuff exciting. Yay. Might not be a lot of video today. Who knows? We don't know. Anyways, bye bye This is where we're going to start the ship tour. Deck three. On the elevators. Let's go. As soon as you get off the elevators, short excursions desk. They'll hit you up with all your good fun short excursions. And there is Opus right there. This is the restaurant. Um, it is the set dining time. Coming up to your right is the passport bar. This is the main lobby. Guest relations is over there. Yeah. And then it's just state rooms down this way. So let's go to deck four. The elevator. We're on our way to deck four, but this is the elevators. That's like the tree of life. The bottom side has LEDs. The top side is a real tree. Maybe we can see that when we get up there. Okay, now we're on deck four. As soon as you get off the elevators and you turn to the left, once again you see Opus. This level is for the anytime dining, reservations needed. And then you have this very nice sitting area here this is the martini bar this is more like a alchemy bar on carnival kind of thing and when when it's open they'll have bottles out here sitting on this place And we'll walk to the other side. This is Cellar Masters. This is more like a wine bar. People just come and like to come in here, sit, and have some wine and have a good time. <clears throat> and it just brings you out back to Opus. Okay. Turn and go the other way decks three four five and six are mostly where the shops and all that good stuff are so 
here's the casino. This is all we can do. We can't film in there, but if you like the casino, it's on deck four, midship. All right, we're gonna go down the shops. Casino bar. There's like serendipity. Just watches, purses, that kind of stuff. Black Friday sales going on. There's the marketplace. Just more shops. Flexion shop. And then here's the art gallery, which they don't have very much art in right at the moment. Here is where you buy spirits on board. It's called Spirits and Such. Here's a more. Nice little bar and lounge right here. They're doing the art gallery. Here's your future cruise area. And then, oh, there's all the art. Right there. Art auction. Okay. There's the stairs. And then all the way forward, we have the Reflection Theater. Looks like they have it closed right now, so we won't go in there. Let's go see. Reflection Theater. And this is Celebrity Central, which is off to the right of the theater. Okay, so this must be like karaoke lounge or comedy lounge or something. But we haven't been in here. Pretty cool. Now we're all the way forward on deck five. Once again, it goes to the theater. You can go, looks like you can go outside here. There's an observation area out here. All the lifeboats are. This is a smoking section for anybody who needs to smoke. So if you come off of deck five, right beside the uh, theater. There you go. All right, here is Adagio, which.
which looks like is perfume. I think alone. There's jasmine. More perfume, more fragrance. They have handbags. All the purses, all the fancy purses. And Moda. Which looks like they're all the same store, but. Um, got your Louis Vuitton there. And then right in the middle, they have photo gallery. This is where they do all your pictures. They still do paper copies. There's another exit that's out. If you want to buy some watches, it's called Pieces of Time. That's where all your watches and stuff are. I've been noticing some, you know, my shoulder, like my garments are getting filled again. Yeah. And then this is part of the main jewelry. It's called Artesian Studio. So if you're looking to buy jewelry and everything, this is your spot. Here they have more shiny things, mostly watches, it looks like. And then, off to the jewelry, they have the world class bar. They do craft cocktails and all that. Very fancy drinks. This is really high tech stuff. Continuing down deck five, you come to Cafe Al Bacchio. This is included. Well, the pastry and stuff. Are. This is a coffee bar, and most of the coffees are like five dollars. Here is the gelato bar. Not much of gelato right now, but it will be. This is an extra charge, so keep that in mind. Now let's go into the Ensemble Lounge. We find this room to be very interesting. It's got flowers and all kinds of stuff there. And when you sit there, it kind of looks like you're just sitting in space. So, very interesting room. Very cool. All right. Okay, over here. Got Michael's Club. This is for the sweet guests. This is their restaurant. This is you can only go in there if you have a suite. <laughs> Continuing down. This is where all your specialty restaurants are. Cuisine, Tuscan Grillo. In blue. Here's another one of these cool, cool.
cool rooms. They got some interesting designs on this ship. So it's pretty neat. This is Cuisine. This is where they do um, that petite chef where they have the characters on your plates. This is the menu. And then over here is Blue. This is for Aqua, Qua Aqua Class. If you have aqua class, you're allowed to go in there. And then this is Tuscan Grill, which is Italian. Anybody can go in there, but it is an upcharge. Okay, here's another restaurant. It's a pay restaurant. It's the Sushi on Fries. And it's kind of right off the elevators. Here's the menu. So it looks like deck five has a deck that you can go all the way around the ship on. Like an exterior deck if you want to see the water and just go walking. It looks like you can go pretty much around the whole ship. That's interesting to know. Okay, on deck six, this is gonna be all we show of deck six because it's all state rooms except for this. This is like it's called the Celebrity Eye Lounge. And it's basically an Apple store. So let's take a quick walk in here. So you're actually allowed to use these computers. That is if you have a Wi-Fi package and all that stuff. You can log into your room and all that good stuff. So pretty cool. Now we're going to go to deck seven to the hideaway. Here's a good angle of the tree of life kind of thing. The upside down tree. This is on deck six, and we're between six and seven. There's a map. On deck seven, this is the hideaway. All these cool little cubby seatings. This is the only thing on deck seven um, other than staterooms, so we're gonna go on to deck eight. Okay, we're on deck nine now. Deck eight is staterooms. Deck nine is staterooms, but they have a cool area up here. It's called Game On. And this is where you can come and play games.
board games. They have these games on the table. A place for you to bring the kids. Or if you're a kid at heart, just come check out Game On on Deck 9. Okay. Now we're on Deck 10. Most of this deck is state rooms as well. This is where the library is. And this library is massive. The book's up on the top shelf you can't get to, but it's very well decorated. Come in here, you read a book, check out the book. You just sit here and relax. They have a cool saying there. It says, the world is a looking glass. So look, so be certain you are smiling, is what it says. The world is a looking glass, so be certain you are smiling. We thought that's pretty cool. Okay, from here, we're gonna go to deck 12. Deck 11 is all state rooms, so don't wanna disturb everyone. So let's go to deck 12. Okay, up on deck 12, here is the concierge. So if you have probably the suites and upper class, this is the captain's club area, concierge, all that good stuff. Let's head forward and let's go check out the spa area. Okay, now we're at the fitness center for all you lovely people who like to exercise on your cruise. They do have a Medi Spa clinic. I think that's where if you want to go get Botox or something like that, you can do that. All right. This is like a yoga area to where you can just zen out if you want. There's some spa cabins down there. Maybe that's... I think they're consulting rooms. I think that's consulting rooms, so. There is the men's locker room. Quick look, maybe there's nothing indecent. Lockers. And you got showers and everything. There's a women's. We're not going to go in there. I can hear people when they're talking. <laughs> There's a barber if you want to get your hair done. For men, if you want to get your hair done. Let me check my schedule and I'll come to you. Let me try to have your name. Yeah. Here's a salon for the ladies to get. Anything they need to get. Yeah. And that's just scheduling a waiting area reception. Okay, when you come off the elevators on 14, there is the Ocean View Cafe, which is the buffet. So let's go outside now. Alright, once you 
get outside. Obviously you got pools, hot tubs, the pool bars over there. This is the Pleto deck. All right, let's go to the solarium. Quick view of the solarium. No kids under the age of 16 in here. And then they have this nice cafe back here. Aqua Spa Cafe. Okay, next thing on deck 14 is the Sky Observation Lounge. They have a lot of uh, pub quizzes and things like that in here. Lots of trivia, all that good stuff. They do have a bar in here. Just a good, nice place to see the ocean. Camp at Sea is on deck 15. That's for the kiddos. Okay, on deck 15, there is a food option out here. It's called the Mass Grill, which right now is empty, but they have hamburgers and hot dogs. And they're open for lunch. That's the menu right there. Celebrity burger, veggie burger, hot dog, french fries, a beef burger, and a turkey burger. Fun stuff on deck 15. It's a little bit like Facebook, Instagram, or social media. Maybe don't scroll down. If you don't have dates, you always see this. The studio is there. So if you want to book some private photography sessions, that's where you will go. We're going to have an office versus get challenge. These are morning trivia and quiz. Here's the line club. Actually, real grass. We're going to be in a safe archery competition where everybody can play. You can see all that out there. Uh, they're watching the World Cup soccer. If you keep on going, there's a putting green for the golfers out there. And then goes to the 
Sunset Bar. And you can come out here and see the trail. This is our favorite part. this side they have um, Bashi ball or Boki ball however you say it. Ladder ball. And yeah that's the ladder ball right there. So let's keep on going. I called it the front porch, but it's just the porch. You can come out here and you can sit here and everything. Enjoy the nice fresh grass. Watch the World Cup. This concludes our ship tour. It's kind of broken up, yes, but trying to be respectful of people. I hope this helps. If you have any questions, send us a message.